ride this morning was, it was expected, but unexpected because it was pretty freaking early. A lot of us are heroin addicts. We did not have time to have our morning fix or nothing. A lot of us are sick. Across the street, they're almost already done. Half of them don't even know because they're gone getting better right now. I was told that there should be paddy wagons. I'm not going to stick around to find out. Where are you going to go? Uh, probably I'll back, I wait a day or two and I'll come right back. That's what we did last time. I've been, I've been here for almost two years straight. The city, the ones with the orange and yellow, some of them really good, a few of them became friends, gave us heads up at a time. I don't think it's right at all. They haven't, they haven't specified where they're gonna put all the people. They've just said that they're gonna house their stuff in black bins and where are all the people going? They haven't said anything about that, right? I know lots of people down here, yeah. I go to the block meetings every Monday at four o'clock, right? And uh, we've been talking about trying to block them by locking arms and, and stopping them. And, and no one did it today. And I don't understand why. This is a serious situation. There's a lot of people down here that don't belong out here, you know? And some people choose to be out here. But it's not up to these guys to tell us where we can and can't live. I work down here. I did live down here. See, they're sending more officers. This isn't a war. These are people that are homeless. They don't have houses. They're going to be back down here this evening. I'm absolutely dumbfounded and I'm really disappointed in Canada. This should never happen. Never happen. And you know, we've been working at this for years. This is repetitive. They need help. And all they're required to do is give them a card to go to housing. We have no housing. There is no housing. Where are we going to put them?